How I made these garnet nails. As usual, I'm starting with an apre nail tip. I'm using the Cocoist flat brush and getting some of Cocoist black cherry. And then I'm going to place that on where I want the darker parts of the garnet. I use the brush to spread it all over the parts of the nail that I want covered in the darker red. Now I haven't cured and I'm going in and getting some rouge red to fill in those empty spaces that I just left after I put on the black cherry. I'm blending that to look a little more natural. Then I'm taking some art clear and placing that where I want more transparent areas because Garnet does have a lot of transparency. After curing that, I'm going to take more black cherry and darken up the areas that I want to be dark. And then using some more rouge red to blend out those lighter areas. And again with art clear to make sure that I'm getting some transparency. Next, I'm using the thin liner brush with bluey white to create some really thin veiny lines. I noticed in reference photos that these lines tend to be really thin or um, very blended, um, so like sharp cut edges. So I'm really trying to get the feel that I'm getting from the reference photos that I found online. After putting down those lines, I'm taking the flat brush again and blending out any thick areas. And the reason that I'm doing that is because there aren't really any like harsh lines or thick lines in the reference photos of Garnet that I could see. So then I cured that and I mixed together Art Clear and Black Cherry to get a transparent gel to put over the white lines. And again, the reason why I'm doing that is because Garnet doesn't have any sort of harsh white in it. And I cured that and now it's time to top coat and cure again. And it's all done. I really, really like this one. Uh, the whole set was really cute together. Um, I hope that you learned something new today and please consider subscribing to my channel. Thank you.